Kiefer dedicated himself to investigating the interwoven patterns of German mythology and history and the way they contributed to the rise of fascism. He confronted these issues by violating aesthetic taboos and resurrecting sublimated icons. The Monumental Sunship, Das Sonnenschiff, 1984-95 depicts an expansive tilled field, over which is set a large airplane made of lead, shaped like a paper plane. The motif of the tilled field recurs throughout Kiefer's work, where it alludes to the German countryside, transformed by centuries of cultivation and farming. Here, as elsewhere, Kiefer invokes the role of landscape in the history of German painting, particularly the appropriation, and subsequent discrediting, of the Romantic tradition by the Nazis. The highly scarred and dash-covered surface of sunship, equally typical of Kiefer's paintings, also refers to the devastation incurred by aerial bombing during World War II. The sunflowers borne by the plane, however, might suggest the potential for regeneration. It's good, Ludwig, no? Good. I'm called Anselm Kiefer. I'm now in the uh, Museum of San Francisco and I'm sitting uh, in the German floor. When I made these paintings, I made in the 80s. Um, yes, I just look around. Uh, yes, it was in a, in a small schoolhouse in the most retired part of Germany. It's a kind of mythological landscape. I was surrounded by meaningful things. And there I constructed my world. At first, each people, each um, government writes his history. The, the history doesn't exist. You cannot, you cannot do it really objectively. So for me, history is then a, a clay, an argile, to build with. 